Welcome back to Breaking Rares with the Barkers. I am Danielle, and this is Austin Barker, my handsome husband. Thank you guys for joining us. Uh, we are going to be changing things up a little bit. We've decided that recently we want to kind of get more into a niche for the channel, and we've just decided that we want to kick things off with a brewery tour, a little like mini series, and we really want to try to just put all of our videos together as being food and travel videos but normally our channel is for college students this series will be for those 21 and up here in the US so if you like food and travel then be sure to hit that like and subscribe button hit that bell so that way you can join us along for our adventures now the hot weather has come in full force here in Arkansas now and with hot weather <laughs> means fireworks and it means good beer that's right so it is extremely hot here and the reason why a brewery tour is so good is because you can get out of the heat especially when you've been like you know out you know mowing you've been working in the yard even traveling sometimes you're in the car you're like man let me get out of here get into a place get you uh you know a pretzel and cheese some beer just kick back and relax even if it's cool enough you can go play some cornhole <laughs> yep so so we have decided to start this mini series on our channel because the Arkansas Brewers Guild has released a map of the 42 different breweries that are a part of their guild and we're going to try as many of them as we can. Yeah, so you get a map, you get a stamp for each brewery that you go to. When you fill up a region, then you get a prize. So, but then when you fill up the entire state, you get a grand prize. Oh. I don't know what that is. Hopefully we can get that grand prize. I mean, I'd be happy to even just finish a region because it's true. the region that we start out with in this series it's happens the to be the largest chunk of it, but we're going to do it for you guys. We are happy to be the guinea pigs to take on this challenge for you guys, searching down the best beer and giving you guys our honest opinion. I'm not claiming to be an expert, but I'm just saying I've drank a lot of beer. Stouts, Pilsners, Ales. Golden Ales, <laughs> IPAs, Pale Ales, Sessions, nobody likes Sessions, Saisons, Sa Sa how do you say it, Saisons, <laughs> um, Ciders, mm. uh, um, Seltzers, Seltzers, all of them. We've been there, we did that, we're going to go do it again for you, let's go! You can see me outside of the uh, brewery getting pumped for some beer. We're here at Oxman Brewing Co. Uh, in Ozark, Arkansas. Totally different layout and building than what you might expect for a brewery. Here you can see they have their different uh, brews on tap. And guys, when we come to a place like this, we like to get a flight set up. That way you can just try everything they have to offer. So we did two flights. That way we could have eight. And one beer really stuck out to us. And that was the uh, Brew Therapy. So guys, when you get the brew therapy, you have to get the strawberries in it. It's just so light and refreshing. On a hot day, here it is. So, so good and crisp. Now, this place started back in 2017 as a hobby between a uh, couple in the educational field. And ever since then, it's just really took off. They even have a mug club, you can see here, with different like hand-painted and crafted mugs from Fayetteville. Such a cool idea because you get uh, a pour, essentially you get more for what you pay for by being a part of the mug club. They're just really cool looking. Also, it's like they have different stuff here in the gift shop that you can buy. Growlers, t-shirts, and glasses that are all uh, designed. This is just a cool place. They hold cornhole tournaments. They do uh, pizzas that are made off site. It's just, you know, they're really pet friendly and family, you know, uh, they're, they're very centered around family. So that's one of the, another cool thing about it. We really like this t-shirt right here with the little French bullies on it. One last thing that we wanted to throw in here is that if you can't make the drive to Ozark, Arkansas to get this, then check out Sodi's in Fort Smith, Arkansas, and they now have a few bottles there. Overall, we loved the Oxman Brewing Company beer. We definitely think that you guys should take the drive and go see what this hidden gem has to offer. Austin obviously gives it two thumbs up. So that wraps up this episode of our mini-series of our Arkansas breweries. 
Right, be sure to stay tuned for the next in the series. And if you guys want to follow along and do this too, if you're visiting Arkansas or you're local here, uh, you can go to the ArkansasBrewersGuild.com to find the closest location and brewery to you. That way you can pick up an official map. It has to be an official map. And then you can get started on your stamps. So, Yeah. And on their website, they also have um, sneak peeks into upcoming breweries that are going to be o opening in Arkansas. Mm. So you get the inside scoop as well. It's true. You, you, you want to know these things. You're yeah. like, hey. I gotta go try this guy. Trust. <laughs> gotta gotta go try their stuff. Yeah. Yeah. All right. If you liked this again, please be sure to like and subscribe. Join us um, for our upcoming videos. And yeah, thank you so 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 much for tuning in. Thank you guys so much. Like she said, like subscribe. We love you. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Till next time on Breaking, Breaking Barriers with the Barkers. Barkers. Food and travel. <laughs> so. so if you're new to this channel, that's what you will be seeing. If not, then I don't know where I'm Swerve. <laughs> Food and travel. How do you do that? You go. You gotta give it some flavor. You gotta give it some zest. You're all the zest, sweetie. You, you got all the zest. All the flavor. Can I give it some funk? Like blue cheese. <laughs>